Welcome back. Donovan said it games ready to bring you some more action on this September 17th of 2021. And it's time to play a game I like to call, Let's Go Beat Up the Millionaire! <laughs> All right, how many of you are play- Oh, solo mio, eh? Okie dokie. Let's go beat up the millionaire. Well, generic contestant, pick the millionaire that you'd like to pound on. All right, get my problems to, uh, seek up to old chick pee. <laughs> Maybe if you win, he'll take you for a ride on his magic carpet. <laughs> and oh yeah, these are the beating keys. Can't have a game. <laughs> Make up! <laughs> what show is this, hey? Hello everybody, and welcome to Who Wants to Beat Up a Millionaire? Okay. Here are the rules. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. No, you go ahead. Not really. I was talking, but you go ahead. <laughs> Jack and Jill went up a hill to fetch what? A Is it A, B, C, or D? <laughs> well, there they are. <laughs> this will be your final answer. Okay, let's see. You chose answer A. The right answer is... Right, oh my it. god! Right you there, got right. it! Alright, speed up this. So, Lone Ranger, time to dish out by. some pain! It's got this. Well, you hey, broke the skin, you're but lucky you didn't I... break a sweat. You're lucky I didn't take my vitamin C today. <laughs> It's time for the next question. Besides artistic glory, what did Michelangelo cover the Sistine Chapel with? Is it A, B, C, or D? So, what do you think? Anything jumping out at you? She's a lifeboat. All right, you got all your lifeboats at your disposal. Time for the magic fortune cookie. After selecting your answer, we'll break open the fortune cookie and see what it says. Then you can choose a new answer, or stay with the one that you've chosen. Okay, pal, pick the answer that you think may be right. Uh. Now let's see what the fortune cookie has to say. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay. Now, it's final answer time. Okay, let's see. You chose answer A. The right answer is... A! Oh, yeah. You are correct. Although, with that kind of help, it's really no surprise. So, single player game person. We've now reached the ultraviolet portion of our show. Ah! Down only ah, half a mil. You're yeah. nothing. Oh, eagle! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that was rough enough to let him know you mean business. This is no cakewalk, people. Okay, let's see what you make of this next question. The number 42 was recently retired in honor of what famous sports hero? Is it A, B, C, Jackie or D? Robinson. Okay, good choice. Final answer. All righty then, you went with choice B. And the right answer is... B! Yes. You got it! Oh, I got a weapon. Wow! Lucky, lucky you. Let's see what you've won. Well, Egregious, our lucky player will be using the following special weapon. Oh, no, no. This can of oil is just filled <laughs> with the good stuff this greedy guy built his empire on. So why not use it to throw some sense into him? him? Crude, you say? Oh, hey, oh. that's on the inside. Well, hockey puck, it's time to move on to the ass whipping. Uh, oh, 200k left. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, king, wow. 100 grand left. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh. My, oh my, a 
Ferocious, Beady. Absolutely ferocious. Oh, I have these motor oil. That's funny. Let's see if this next question is a blessing or a curse. <laughs> okay. In the longest Stanley Cup Finals game, Colorado defeated what team in three overtimes? Is it A, B, C, or D? Okay, which one looks right to you? Okay, you've used up one lifeboat already. Now, if my math is correct, that only leaves you with, um... You've chosen one or the other. Here's the deal. We'll take away two of the oh, wrong answers the and Panthers. leave you with oh, a 50-50 chance of getting it right. Sound fair to you? Well, it sounds fair to us, so that's why we do it. I think it's the four Panthers because the Avalanche only won one Stanley Cup and it was against the Okay, you got a 50-50 shot here. I guess that's your final answer. You know, with the kind of money this show makes, you think we can get some new writers, get some new material. Well, that's just me. Try C, huh? Let's see. The correct answer is... C! Yes. If you were any more right, you'd be Jesse Helms. With those kind of odds, I bet you could do anything. At least half the time. Okay, shout ahead. Get ready to put the smack in SmackDown! 50k to go! I'm surprised that person still has vital signs after that drubbing! That's right, I said it, it was a drubbing! All righty, it's time for another question. What's the Roman name for Poseidon? Uh, Is it A, B, C, or D? Okay, which one looks right to you? <laughs> what show is this? Hey, final answer. Try C, huh? Let's see. The correct answer is... C. Oh, my... You got it. Wouldn't have put a dollar on that one. So, Bella, get ready to kick ass and take some names. And you know what? Forget about the names. They should tape that and put it in the next Rocky movie. Just brutal. <laughs> Okay, while you wipe your knuckles off, I will ask the next question. <laughs> what over-the-counter medicine is said to help lower the risk of a heart attack? Is it A, B, C, or D? Well, there they are. I wish I could help, <laughs> but to be honest, I'm reading these things fanatically. You're on your own. I'm gonna say aspirin. So I guess that's your final answer. And for our Spanish-speaking audience, uh, your ultima respuesta. Try C, huh? Allergies. Let's see. The like correct allergies. answer is... C! Yeah. Yes! Okay, player dude. Go ahead and make your day. <laughs> One grand! Scud <laughs> nice. Holy moly! Remind me not to get on your bad side. Okay, let's see if all that venting stimulated any brain activity. Time for the next question. Who invented baseball? Okay, here are the four choices. At least one of which I will mispronounce. Is it A, B, C, or D? Okay, day. now, so that's your final answer. Well, good luck with that. You look like a good person. Not that I can really see you. And if you think I can see you, you're a moron. You're on a computer. Okay, let's see. You chose answer A. The right answer is... A. Correct Amunda. So, fella, your prey awaits. 
You're not a pacifist. <laughs> Let's have a gander oh. at the next question. Oh, he's only down to... Which of these a breath. was outlawed by the Puritans in 1643? Is it A, B, C, or D? So, what do you think? Anything jumping out at you? Keep in mind, you only have one lifeboat left. So, scared, huh? Well, you chose to chicken out. Since this question is obviously too hard for you, we will shuffle the deck and choose a brand new one. Hopefully, this one will be easier. But if not, too bad. <laughs> Let's see what your new question will be. Okay. Which rider wound up in the nut house? Is it A, B, C, or D? Okay, which one looks right to you? Uh, this will be your final answer. And for our hearing impaired, final answer! So, you've picked A. No turning back now. A is your choice. Oh, Let's see if it's A. Okay. <laughs> I cracked myself up. All right, we're looking for A. And the right answer is... B. Oh! Well, too bad you're wrong. Big surprise it's there. Sad. Well, generic oh, contestant, so you got pretty far, my friend, but not far enough. That reminds me of an old Hungarian proverb, which I uh, keep meaning to get translated so I can figure out what oh. the hell it means. Well, that was exciting, that was but whether tough. you want to lose isn't no really important. Left. What's important is that I make roughly $3,000 for every word I read. <laughs> there, I just raked in 90 grand, and that was another 18000 this is a greatest fill-in, and I'll see you next time on Who Wants to Beat Up a Millionaire? Oh no! So close to killing that millionaire. Oh. Dang it. We'll get you next time. We'll get him next time. I am... So mad at myself right now, but we'll get him next time. As always, leave a like, subscribe, visit my store at denagames.storeenvy.com, and visit my podcast links on Spotify Premium and Anchor FM.